Uh, greetings, everyone. We're here today at uh, Smoky Blues Barbecue. We're here with uh, Charles Mosley and uh, Rob Walton, owners of Smoky Blues here on uh, Highway 80. And so good to have you guys in here today. And uh, wanted to uh, know more about your business. Tell us a little bit about Smoky Blues Barbecue and what you all do. You know what, what you serve and all that. Well, Smoky Blues is uh, king of barbecue. We try to have all the types of barbecue that a person want to want. We have uh, beef ribs, we have pork ribs, fried ribs, rib tips, riblets. Uh, so any kind of rib that you would want. Of course, we have chicken and brisket and pork as well. But um, all your barbecue meats, we serve those here. So this is really one of the only places in Jackson that you can come and get all your one-stop shopping here. Okay. So what's your hours of operation every day? It's a 10 to 10. We we'll open at 10 in the morning and close at 10 at night. Okay, so how are things going so far? How long have you been here? How have things been going so far? So you open about two or two and a half months. Uh, it's been steady. Uh, we just trying to get the word out that we're open. Uh, we're in the old Sunny's Barbecue building, and uh, most of you know that uh, Sunny's Barbecue closed about two years ago in this mm -hmm. area. Uh, Sunny's was probably one of the main state businesses in this area at the time, and uh, they closed yeah. in Jackson. And uh, one of the things Rob and I are really invested in is bringing back business to Jackson. Um, I truly believe, you know, that we're not going to fix Jackson, nobody else will. You know, I'm born and raised in Jackson, and I've got a vested uh, stake here in making sure that Jackson's first. Okay. So when I say that, you know, we put our money where our mouth is. You know, our money is invested here in, in Highway 80 in Jackson to make sure this business can thrive and to create jobs for Jacksonians, you know, tax dollars for Jacksonians as well. Okay. Uh one of the other things, like you're here right here on Highway 80 in this kind of, this, right this South Jackson corridor. Why did you cho choose to move right here in this South Jackson area and not, you know, somewhere else? Well, I, I think that we're looking for impact, you know, and um, to impact our area, I can't go to Madison or I can't go to Caroline Road and impact this area. Mm. You know, we should have someone nice to come on this side of town and eat. We have karaoke on Wednesday nights and live blues on Saturday nights. You should be able to bring your wife or your significant other out, you know, to come out somewhere nice, you know, and have a nice evening without having to go out on Caroline Road. Okay. So y'all do not only, y'all do fish too, right? Oh, yeah. Pan trout and catfish. Okay. So uh, what did you think? I said, I mean, you asked a lot of questions for me already. What do y'all think, lastly, uh, what could we do or the business could do to help serve the community better and uh, try to help transform this area even more? I think well, we, we're, we're working on now, uh, working with community projects like bringing in, um, you know, the different schools around in the area in the community uh, with the kids, uh, promoting, uh, you know, feeding healthy meals to them other than just your basic, you know, hamburger and french fries type mm -hmm. stuff. You know, we're opening it up to them to learn uh, more about our music, uh, blues around here in this area. Uh, you'd be surprised on some of the nights we have live blues here. We have very young children. I'm talking about children that go to middle school and, okay. and, and elementary who come sit right here in the front and, and, and talk to the blues artists because they're interested in it. Okay. Um, you know, one of the funny things that I say to them is, you know, don't go back to school in the morning and tell them you hung out all night at the blues joint. <laughs> you know, but, you know, th that's one of the other impacts that we want to do. We want to show that, you know, we you have a place here to, we, that you can call home for the blues. Gotcha. You know, right. that's, that's where the name came from, uh, Smoky Blues. Okay. Where, where the smoke meets the blues. Yeah. Well, uh, well, I've been here. I, I've, I've come here myself about three or four times. I've I've enjoyed it, my wife and I, and uh, so we plan on coming back again. So tell you the hours of operation one more time. Ten. It's a ten to ten. Ten to ten. ten, to ten yeah. uh, so, and what's the, what's the days? Monday through Sunday. Yeah, and we like to also invite out our, our church people out for Wednesdays after church. Mm -hmm. We got a process called carry home. So then, you know you go to the great church service uh, and had to hear the message. In the word, and you don't quite feel like going home and cooking, mm. you come by here and carry it home. All right. You come by here and get your meal ready for you, go home and eat, and now you go back and lift the finger to cook or clean. Gotcha. Well, appreciate you guys so much for all the work you've done and all the investment you've already made here, and uh, please come out and support them, and we look forward to this place thriving even better. Thank you very much. All right.